Hello guys, in this video we are going to look into some of the de definition that is very important regarding the stochastic process. Now the thing is that first we will take up with the probability vector. Now what is try we will try to understand what is probability vector by taking up some examples and all. So let us see what is the definition. So the probability vector is a vector where all the entries are non zero non negative non negative which are which means they are positive and add up to exactly one now the question may arise is that now what is a vector here it is telling that a vector a vector means i can say vector means a matrix okay a matrix with one single row or I can say column that is nothing but a vector okay a matrix with single row or column it can be like this it can be like this okay now we'll take up some examples so that you will get an idea here so probability vector means a vector which is in the form of matrix entries should be non-negative that means should be positive and add up to what exactly one okay this their sum should be unity okay that is the thing here so let us try to understand by taking some example so u is equal to i'll take one comma zero okay now the thing here is that this is single row where the entries are non-negative which means they are positive correct 1 and 0 are positive and their sum is nothing but 1 when i add 1 plus 0 what it gives 1 so condition is satisfied therefore it is a probability vector let us take one more example suppose v half comma half now this is also a probability vector why the question comes here we have to see the conditions see here this this two entries are positive that means non-negative and when i add this two i'll get one half plus half is what one therefore this is also satisfied let us take one more condi one more ve probability vector one by four one by four one by two now here all the three entries that means the components of the vectors are what components means what this thing this is one component this is one one totally three components are there for the w probability vector now is it a probability vector or not i have to add all the three components i should get what one am i getting yes one plus one by four plus one by four plus one by two is one and the numbers are positive also and this is in what a matrix form where we have only a one single row it can be column also like this also you can consider where 1 by 4 1 by 4 and 1 by 2 so i have to add all these terms correct so one note is there that we need to understand is that one more thing if suppose v is a vector which is given as 1 comma 2 comma 3 okay it is not a probability vector but the entries what whatever the entries are non-negative see we have this condition and this condition correct so it is satisfy, satisfying one of the conditions but when i add all this i won't get i won't be getting what one correct but the entries are non-negative one two are uh, three are positive numbers but their sum is not equal to what unity but still but I, what i can do i can introduce one lambda which will make this as a probability vector how it is possible so lambda which is equal to what one by summation of whatever v components are there so i can write it as summation of v i where i will start from where from one you can say one to n numbers here one two three are the numbers so 
1 by summation of all the three terms 1 2 3 what is that so 1 2 3 it's 6 so I got lambda equal to 1 by 6 so I can write lambda V will be uh, will be what probability vector okay so lambda V will be what probability vector so it is not necessary that the given thing so you can convert this is a conversion process where the entries are non-negative but it is the sum is not one so you can make that sum one and you can express it as lambda v which is a probability vector correct where lambda is equal to this so where lambda is one by six so i can finally write v vector as what lambda into v i can write vi that means v first term i'll take so lambda into 1 is 1 by 6 2 into 1 by 6 is 2 by 6 3 into 1 by 6 is 3 by 6 that's it now when i add all these terms these are positive numbers non negative this is a one single row matrix and when i add all the three terms three components of this vector i'll get as 1 1 by 6 2 by 6 3 by 6 when i add together i'll get it as what 1 so we'll take up with the second part of this so it is nothing but stochastic matrix now what is that it's basically a matrix a square matrix a square matrix it is denoted by p we can say okay or any alphabet you can take p i j means i maybe the row j we can take this column any of this okay now having every row in the form of a probability vector we have discussed about probability vector so i'll just explain you one taking one example probability vector means what there's some their components their entries should be non-negative and second condition is that some should be some of the entries should be one so st stochastic matrix example i'll take suppose i'll take one identity matrix 1 0 0 1 2 cross 2 cross 2 means 2 rows 2 columns so here when i add this row the row should be in the form of what every row this is a square matrix because it is 2 cross 2 1 plus 0 is what 1 0 plus 1 is 1 correct that means entries are what positive numbers and their sum is also equal to 1 we are discussing about only the row and it is a square matrix so we got here two conditions one it should be a square matrix and the sum should be what of row row should be what unity that means probability vector it should be in the form of probability vector every row let us take one more I, if I take identity matrix for 3 cross 3 it is also a square matrix 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1 again the same thing if i add i'll get 1 1 1 every row correct if i take some other example half 0 half 1 so if i add row i'll get 1 here also i'll get 1 and the entries are also positive numbers okay so like this you can create more examples and try to understand this so stochastic matrix means it is a square matrix where every row will be in the form of what probability vector okay 